been sleeping. I'm ready to conquer humanity and I thirst for their blood now more than ever. Kravis, I've chosen you to go to the legendary world city of Maiden. The city is sprawling with humans one night of the year. 300 years from now, in 2014, you will visit the city and you will lay the foundation for an under takeover. I would be happy to, my Countess. Shall I leave tonight? If this world is wearing thin And you're thinking of escape I'll go anywhere with you Just wrap me up in chains You'd better hope and pray That you make it safe back to your own Well done on putting Walker away there last month. How was your break? It was too fucking short. You know what? I sat by the pool in one of those cheap resorts in Romania. Get this. They still put garlic on the windows. They keep vampires out. <laughs> Are you serious? Fuck off. No, I just set up for a crack. What do you think, like? Ah, uh, you're one strange geezer, you know that? You know what? This city has gone to the dogs. There's nothing but vice. What drug rings, prostitution, all that crap. This city needs its number one detective. You know what? That's you, short. And it needs him sober. Yeah, yeah. I'll track it down. But... On my terms. Listen to me now. Who makes the rules around here? Have a bit of fucking respect, will you? You see, if you weren't my boss, I'd knock you out. You see, if you weren't my number one detective, I'd be degrading you to traffic branch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, traffic branch. <laughs> yeah. This is Bart Bart for BBN News in Derry, the Derry Broadcast News. I'm here with Mr. Bill Waters, that is Mayor Waters, the Mayor of Derry. I'm joined by Mayor Waters today, so how are you today, Bill? I'm good, Bart. How about you? I'm okay, Bill. How are you? 
Well, that could be better, but, but at least we have some with decent weather, so things aren't too bad. Uh, tell me, uh, Bill, are, are you taking any actions to do with these tragic events on the walls? <laughs> uh, yeah, we are, but it's very, very tragic. But I have made sure that our wonderful police service of this city are taking action, stern action, to get to the bottom of this, all, all this hassle that's been happening in, in our wonderful walled city. Thank you very much for joining us today, Mayor Waters. See you later. This has been Bart Barrett for DBN News. Thank you, Bart. Thank you, Bill. Things aren't good, Jim. I know. It's getting out of hand. I've had reports of dead people on the walls. And a dark figure. Who the fuck gives you your reports? The Derry Globes? Should they haven't been genuine since they reported Mayor Waters drowned? Which was false. Can we be serious for one fucking minute short? This is blood we're dealing with here. And before it's all over, it could be our blood. Jesus, put me on a downer way, don't you? How am I meant to deal with this? Well, that's where your new partner comes in. There's a new guy on the scene, a new detective, a trainee detective. And he wants to learn from the best. And that's you, Short. Fuck's sake, I don't need a partner. I can hardly look after myself. How am I going to look after some young fucker as well? Let me introduce to you, Ensign Young. Oh, uh, Jimmy, you can call me Kev. Sweet Jesus. Welcome to the team, Ensign Young. I understand you've worked in Romania, Bucharest, and you've studied in the University of Tennessee. Well, sir. And you're an Elvis impersonator. Your man has to let loose. <laughs> right. Let's get one thing straight here. I'm the boss. Be my guest, but don't be cruel. All right, boys. Can we be fucking serious for a minute here? Let's get to work.
Do you realise the serious effect we're up against here? I mean, it's a no-known enemy. Supposedly a vampire. Let's get serious. Well, it's a fit situation. I've never been reading all about these characters in them, uh, when I was in Bucharest in Romania. Oh, and I suppose you've watched uh, From Dawn to Dusk and Dracula. Wait, now you're Wesley Snipes, right? Garrett does work. Wooden Stakes doesn't, but. Hmm. Interesting. So you're not a bubblegum pop after all? You know what? I may start calling you Tootie Fruity. If you do, I'm going to call you Moody Blue. Ah, forget it, come on. 